Happy Friday, everyone. It's a great weekend as we consider this phrase, which is repeated many times through scripture. You're going to know it as soon as I say it. Give thanks to the Lord for he is good, for his love endures forever. That's Psalm 106, verse 1. You know, how are you going to give thanks as you go into this weekend? The Lord's calling us to do it. It's interesting that he doesn't say be thankful or just have thanks. He actually instructs us to do something about it, to give thanks. That's action. So again, how will you do that this weekend? Because the Lord is good. He's good to you and he's good to me. One of the ways that we can give thanks to the Lord is in prayer by verbally telling him. Pause and tell him, thank you, God, for your goodness. We can also praise God in all circumstances, the scripture tells us, because we know that through all things, God is working for our good. Because again, the Lord is good and his love endures forever. So I wanna encourage you this weekend as we go into this weekend celebrating, let's give thanks to the Lord for he is good and his love endures forever. Would you join me for a word of prayer? God, you are good and we celebrate and we thank you for your goodness. Your love does endure forever. And while we were yet still sinners, you sent your son out of your good love and grace to come and save us. And we thank you for that gift of salvation. Help us celebrate that as we live out in our lives, as we again pray to you, as we sing to you and worship, as we live our lives. May everything we do and say be a reflection of the gratitude, not only that we have, but the gratitude that we give because you are good and your love endures forever. We pray this in Jesus' name.